are sharing with you a Walmart grocery haul. It's just a small one. This is more of our fill-in haul. Um, we actually, hummingbird, we actually could have not even went this week and been fine. However, we needed some produce um, and we needed milk. So we definitely had to go because the kids have to have milk for, well, the girls do um, for their iced coffees. <laughs> So we went to Walmart and picked up groceries this week. Like it wasn't much. Um, I mainly went because I wanted to look around and get a few ideas for Nolan for his birthday. Um, I've already I've got stuff planned, but there's also some stuff I don't have planned. He's not picked a theme, which for you, if you've been around here, um, we don't really do much on his birthday or any anybody's birthday, you know, unless they actually specifically ask for something. Um, but we do like theme it and have like a, just a mini party with us. Um, so we usually pick a theme, like I was saying, and he's not picked a theme. So I'm kind of drawing my own ideas. And so I've kind of come up with something unless he picks and then I just not do what I've got, but obviously I've got to have some sort of plan. Um, so anyways, I was looking for stuff that kind of fits my theme. Didn't really have much luck, um, but we'll make it work because we always do. But anyways, we're gonna flip you around and show you everything that we got. Um, I will insert week two's meal plan here again, or maybe I could include the entire thing again. Maybe I should do that in case he wasn't here last week, but um, I'll include the meal plan anyways in just a second. This is just a little fill and haul. We pretty much had everything we needed for that last week for this week's meals. I bought that last week. But, you know, we had to have produce, we had to have milk. I really needed bread, but I really want to make homemade bread. And so, I didn't buy bread because I want to make homemade bread. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and show you everything that we got. For week one, we're going to have, no, the kids won't eat this. I'll find them something else that night. But we're going to have pinto beans and some fried cabbage. We're going to also have Italian drip chicken. It's a recipe that's going to be adapted from Italian drip beef. Um, never had either of them, but I thought it sounded good. So we're going to have Italian drip chicken on homemade Yogi Rose. Yogi Rose? Seriously? Homemade Hoagie Rose with some fries. We're going to have barbecue pulled pork with homemade macaroni and cheese. Chicken wraps with fries or chips. Club sandwiches. A night of yo-yo or leftover. And then a night of night out. Can't talk. For a week two, we're going to have barbecue chicken with macaroni and cheese. I forgot I was going to make a double batch and freeze it, um, but we're going to have that. And then we're going to have tacos or taco salad one night, homemade pizzas, sesame chicken with rice, club sandwiches again, as well as a night of yo-yo or leftovers. We're going to have another night out. All right, so for produce, which we pretty much, I mean, we only did, like, we only did buy fruits this week because we have been getting a majority of our produce out of the garden. We needed romaine lettuce for... Dixie the bunny, but I forgot to grab any. Um, so if we decide she absolutely has to have it, we'll just run out and grab it. But I got some fruit this week. We got some cherries, some black grapes and green grapes. These are the family's favorite, but these black ones are mine. I should have grabbed some blueberries too, I forgot. Anyways, we've been enjoying produce and stuff because it is so warm outside. Um, so we got those and then I also just grabbed a bag of gala apples because we was out of apples grabbed some of the custard field this is Bolivian, but we've always called them custard field donuts for john and nolan and then i got a thing of cornstarch a thing of baking powder and a thing of baking soda this is stuff that's been on the list for probably two or three weeks maybe a month but i just never thought to get it i was completely out of cornstarch but the other two i just wanted to you know, I don't want to run out completely, so I seen them and thought to grab them today, so I did. And then, just walking by, I saw these. It says, pickle-flavored crispy dillies, and my first thought was, them will be really good on, like, a pulled pork sandwich. So, I walked back and got those to put onto pulled pork sandwiches this week. I got a thing of Miracle Whip because I was out, and I usually prefer this over mayonnaise. I've got mayonnaise if I decide I want mayonnaise, but... Grab myself one of those, as well as a thing of hot fudge sauce that I'm going to need for a recipe. Some chocolate chips, just because I've been missing baking. And got my fingers crossed they get the air fixed this week so I can get back to normal life of baking and cooking and stuff correctly. So I grabbed some chocolate chips. Then I got, well, Lily got her some of these, and so she also grabbed Nolan some. So just some of these twin snake gummies. Here. 
and I grabbed these for part of Nolan's birthday theme, unless he picked something. He hasn't picked something, so I've got something in mind that I think I want to do. Um, and if I do that, these will match and go good with it. So I grabbed those. We grabbed a thing of this variety pack of the Great Value Chips. This is like less than $8. Stuff gets wasted less like this. And then I figured, you know, if we end up at the lake, which we don't plan on it this week, but next weekend, if we do end up at the lake, um, these will be good to have. So I went ahead and grabbed those. I don't know if they'll last that long. We'll see if, if they do, they do, if they don't, they don't. But I did go ahead and grab those as well as just a big bag of the dill pickle chips. I grabbed these eclair bars. I'm going to make the um, a treat that Fallon from Moss Family TV made not too long ago. I went ahead and grabbed them. I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. Um, and I'm going to throw that into the video for Friday, for Saturday. Because my vlog yesterday was kind of, eh, we didn't really do nothing. It's kind of boring. Kind of probably short so i figured i'd make that and just go ahead and tie that into the end of it because it is you know part of the weekend i can throw it into the weekend vlog it's i can do what i want so i grabbed a box of those two things of whipped topping and then just a two pack of salted butter i've never tried this flavor i don't think but lily noticed the bottle and how odd it was i thought i assume this is because it's probably easier to hold on to i don't know but it was pretty and I figured we would give it a try because I don't think I've ever tried it. So we grabbed that, got some Ready Whip, but just the Walmart version, as well as some caramel syrup and some almond milk for me. And then just a thing of whole milk. And then they've not had Lily's strawberry banana juice in I don't know how long. It's been super long. Um, which it's what everybody drinks it, but Lil it's just Lily's favorite. So that's what we stick to because nobody else has a favorite. Anyways, we grabbed just a kiwi strawberry for the week. We grabbed two of the cosmic brownies just because nobody's no help when it comes to getting groceries, especially in the summer. I mean, sometimes they are, sometimes they ain't. Lily was a lot of help. I think it was last week. It's because she was hungry. And so she was just really helpful in picking things that she would like. However, nobody was hungry today and we didn't eat a ton anyways, but I wanted to go ahead and grab the kids some of these. Like I said, I've not been baking and stuff as much and you know people like to have snacks so i grabbed two of those and then everything else is non-food i wanted this wendy was wanting some sunblock because she got a little bit burnt at the lake last time just a little bit but um she was wanting some sunblock so i went ahead and grabbed this for her because again she wasn't no help wasn't picking anything i figured this would be good it's water resistant and you know when we're swimming is about the only time that she would want it or need it we're fairly dark to skinned anyways, but if it's something she's wanting and she thinks that it's going to help take care of her body and skin, and, you know, I'm all for that. Um, for her, I don't wear it. But anyways, I did get myself this. It is weightless hydration. It is for after sun lotion, and it smells really good. That's really why I got it, is because it smells good. So I grabbed that for myself. And then... I want to make my macaroni and cheese. I never got around to making any last week, so I went ahead and grabbed some take and toss pans. That way I can make, you know, make one that night and then make an extra because the recipe I follow makes a whole big, you know, family reunion sized dish. So I thought we could make two of those, one for the end and then one for the freezer. And then also went ahead and grabbed just a five pack of these um, little storage containers. These are for the freezer. And I'm going to make some, like, squash casserole type dish. And I figured I could make a couple and put them in the deep freeze and have them ready to go. Just pop them out and bake them. And then this is, this stack of stuff right here costs, like, $60. So this is where, you know, quite a bit of that money went that we spent. Um, I needed one of these for the switch. Like I said, it's almost out of storage. And um, I was back there at seen it. I was looking for a game. They didn't have the game I was looking for. I'm going to buy it on Amazon. You don't care. But um, I did see this, and I've had this on my list for probably five months now to buy one of these. And so I finally went ahead and bought one of these to put into the Switch. You know, it, it makes it to where you can download more stuff. So I got that. This is the curtain set that I was looking for for Lily last week that I was, it was out of stock. Um, I got her curtain rod last week, and then this week we finally found these, which I actually was walking past them because I didn't think they had them. 
um, and Lily seen them. So we grabbed our curtains this week. And then this is one of the gifts that I got Nolan. He's probably up there listening, so I can't say what it is, but I grabbed him that. So yeah, that is what we got this week. All right, friends, and that's gonna be it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you're not part of our family, make sure you subscribe down below. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna go ahead and just throw that ice cream concoction together. I don't remember what it's called. Um, because the ice creams would be a little bit solid right now, so it would be the perfect time to do that. And that way tonight, John can enjoy that. Um, I thought about doing that for Nolan's birthday, for his cake. But then I worried, what if we don't like it? Or what if it isn't quite right? And then I kind of ruin it with trying a new thing on his birthday. I don't know. When you've always got a chance of ruining it when you're making a birthday cake or whatever anyways but i think we're going to throw that together so if you haven't watched that and you're interested in it and you're not part of our family make sure you subscribe down below because i am going to include that in the video that will come up go up on saturday um just to add to it and i really want to make it today and i'm not vlogging today other than this grocery haul um, so make sure if you want to see that you stick around for that or you can go over and go back a couple of videos I don't remember what point and find it from a moss family TV but anyways we're gonna go ahead and get all this stuff put up and yeah make sure you subscribe like I said if you haven't already we're slowly growing over here it's only, it's only took 40 years to get this far not really sometimes it feels like that though but thank you guys for watching thank you for the support we love you all as always remember to show grace be content and live blessed bye friends